Okay, I'm ready. Coming. Stupid This is the this is the one where it's like yo. Anthony Allenworth. Watch out for it. We're not going to get it. Ah, no. Watch out. No. No, don't think. Come on, there you go. Incendio. Incendio is not working. Good. I wonder what else is shooting me. Incendio. So close. Dodge it. Incendio, close enough. Accio. Incendio. Couldn't bring up. That's 
right. Yeah, that's what's up. Oof. What a relief. You think? Wow. Okay, I'm good. I'm good. Let's go. <laughs> Another pensive. Yeah, before we get to it. Midnight Debonair Ensemble. Debonair Nair Nair. <laughs> okay. Your ability to transfigure the world around you is remarkable. What is it? My father isn't getting better. I don't think he'll ever recover from the death of my brother. It is agonizing to see those we love suffer. The drought was years ago. The pain of losing him is as deep for him now as if it had happened only yesterday. He doesn't need pretty pillars, he needs peace. What if I could help him, Professor? You do so much for your father already. It's not enough. I want to take away his pain. It is tempting, I know, to use this magic that you're mastering to transfigure more than the physical world. But human emotion is a potent force unto itself. Even the most well-meaning and competent witch cannot possibly know the consequences of irrevocably manipulating it. So I'm to watch as my father's pain destroys him. It is not your pain to take. She's not listening to you. That, I predict, is Fig's wife. Every year a student sees something sillier than Possibly. I could ever imagine in their tea leaves. Oh, Miss Morgana. Welcome back to Hogwarts, Professor. That's going to take some getting used to. Mm. Professor Rickwood. I was so pleased to hear that you'd accepted the position of Defense Against the Dark Arts, Professor. Sit, sit, Isadora. Tell us about your travels. I was actually hoping that you and the others might join me at my home this evening. There's much I'd like to share with you. That would be delightful. We shall let the others know. Very well. I shall see you then. Interesting. Isadora. Hmm. The name memory. rings a bell. That's not the way out of there. Dumbledore's sister's name? It's not Isadora. It's the one part of... The lies stone. That must be the way back to the map chamber. It's the one part of Harry Potter that intrigued me that I don't know as much about. <laughs> okay. Okay. A boss battle complete. Challenging. It was like... Get in there was challenging. Oh, you are still there. Okay. What have we here? I'm a student at Hogwarts, sir. And this is Professor Fig. Professor Charles Rookwood at your service. Has someone completed the first trial? I have, Professor. Rookwood. 
I've seen you before. We saw you in the pensive in Gringotts, with Professor Rackham. Indeed. So, you found the port key to access Professor Rackham's vault, and you deciphered the map within the locket you found floating above that pensive. I did. I found something that I can't identify floating above the last pensive. Ah, yes. You will find a similar artifact in each trial. You must take care to keep them safe. You'll need them to complete the journey we have set forth for you. Once you have them all, we will tell you what to do with them. Very well. Are you able to tell me anything about the next trial? Before you proceed, I would like to speak with Charles regarding the urgent situation involving the goblins. The goblins? The student has seen traces of a powerful dark magic being wielded by goblin kind. They and their mentor, Professor Fig, not only encountered goblins lurking outside of San Bacar's tower, they also encountered a powerful goblin in my vault at Gringotts. Hmm. I'm afraid it would be wise to halt the trials until we know more. We shall defer to you in this matter, of course. Now then... Wait, Professor. The name Rookwood. Do you think... That there's a connection to Victor? Perhaps. But we can't be sure of its significance, if any. For now... Tell me what you saw in the pensive. Before the witch from the last pensive, Isadora, became a Hogwarts professor, she argued with Professor Rackham about using magic to remove pain. Hmm. Hopefully the next pensive provides more context. For now, we should learn what Ramrock knows. I will be honest. I've no idea where to start. Actually, I might know of someone. I saw Serona at the Three Broomsticks speaking to a goblin once. They seemed friendly. Well, it's worth a try. See what you can find out. Of course, don't forget... My studies. Yes, sir. Uh, before you go... Okay. Professor? Have you encountered swirling traces of magic in the world? Uh, aside from those along our path? Not that I recall. What are they? Evidence of the Keeper's efforts to manipulate the power of ancient magic during our time. If I am correct, and I usually am, you should be able to use them to inform and enhance your own magic. Thank you, sir. I will look out for them. Interesting. Achievement unlock. That's a Keeper. Yo, look at this cutscene. This looks beautiful already. I'm putting my controller down. Yeah. Is it a cutscene? Okay, it was just it was okay. <laughs> right, now we're back at Hogwarts. I right, I'm going to change I got mail as well, but I'm gonna change the look of my wares. Go into my gear. My robe here, let's change the appearance slightly. <laughs> Underneath is literally not wearing, he's wearing his gym jams, man. I took it off by accident as if I was handicapped throughout it. <laughs> no way. Um, oh no, hold up, there is something better than that that I've got. Where, where, where are you? Oh, it's just the appearance that changes, isn't it? Okay, so I will change the appearance of this bad boy to this bad boy. Look at that. That's just ridiculous, that is, isn't it? Like, battle armor underneath. Like, you can actually, you can actually change the appearance of your robe. So you can kind of just wear that. Look at that. What? Yo. <laughs> Uh, that's that's mad. That is mad. I'm leaving like that. That's kind of cool, man. And with the scarf, that's so dope. That's so dope. You're not even. <laughs> well 
Browski. Browski. Do that though. Yeah, okay, yeah, I'm good. Once you know how to do your gear, it's it's a lot better. Look at that one. Man's on some next Hogwarts level. I should ask. I've got spectacular news. The broom upgrade's ready. Ha, stop by the shop when you can. Yeah, about time. Alright, let's go and do our broom I upgrade. I hope real you quick. will come and see me about a pressing and highly confidential matter at your earliest convenience. I believe that we may be able to help each other. Okay, Gladwin Moon. Please see me after. Hold up, I got lots of mail. Hold up, listen. Once you have completed the tasks I have set for you, I would like to teach you Descendo, useful for pulling objects to the ground. 